Okay. 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 Uh, I'm gonna do like uh play of I'm gonna play half life one. Uh my face cam is working. Yeah. And when I last did like a test run of this uh, uh, that's what I was saying, uh, the soldier, the, uh, the soldier blind side has been when I last did a play of this. So, uh, hey, how does he still have so much health as well? There we go. Uh, I, don't, I, I don't think that alien grunt firing the fly gun is actually there. Uh, I think... I think that was just background sounds. Don't you just love how neatly these uh, assault rifles from the from the fall from the fallen soldiers were arranged when they came down from the uh, 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 from the uh, um, the helicopter last episode here uh, um, when when we shut it down here. Yeah. Uh, I, um, I suppose I can hard say it here. It won't matter if I didn't kill that. If I don't kill that soldier, and in case this all goes per se, and I just sort of shininess of the armor, the alien grunts, and their arms, their um, they're useless. Uh, which arm is this? Uh, the useless left arms uh, 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 with that uh, foldy type of skin bit on the end of it, they remind me of giant mouldy versions of the sausages from beans and sausage tins a bit. You know how the sausages end with that wrinkly bit and all at the end. Well. Yeah, they remind me of giant mouldy sausages a bit, uh, useless. Uh, uh, which arm is it again? Uh, their left arms, I think. Uh, 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 so, goodbye, Mr. Alien Club Corps. Uh, and, um, oh, another thing that I wanted to do uh, last time before I press on. Uh, before I press on, my face comes definitely working. Uh, before I press up is um, to refill my ammunition in this in this beautiful ammunition room, stocked full of ammunition. Yeah, except there's not much more I can actually collect this uh, because I. Um, must have collected all of the types that I use. And isn't it nice how this light lights up all of the the undersides of all the ammunition uh, shells? Unfortunately we can't really we can't really crouch low enough to actually see the lights underneath, can we? We only see the floor lit up underneath them. And that's of course these white bits at the sides here are the uh, And that's of course these white bits Unless, of course, these white bits on the size closer to me, the lights, of course. But I digress, and doesn't it look nice to sky out of these gridded windows in this ammunition room as well? I bet it's hot, though, because um, imagine the sun shining in later, and I don't think there can be air conditioning in rooms where there's windows, can there, maybe? I don't know, but to save electricity, Let's turn this off, even though there's a chance this place won't even be standing when all this is said and done. And if you've played Opposing Force, then you know exactly what I mean, don't you? If you've played Opposing Force exactly through... Uh, yeah, yeah, if you've played Opposing Force, then you'll know what I mean, Sonny Jerry Earth. Uh, so now it's time to press on now that I've owned an art so much. I wonder what I should use here though. 
Actually, the assault rifle, that thing uh, seems like it'll be the best bet because I do know what's coming after all. Uh, wonder if I can. Oh, no, I can't stealth this bit. Uh, hide the bullets. Uh, I was. Oh no. I was hoping I could use the turrets for this, but obviously that's not a smart idea. Oh no, he's gonna hurt me. Oh, not really, not the reload for. Uh, why won't you reload? Uh, there we go. Yes, it's not a case of me being in there, but it's a case of the game. Uh, um, malfunctioning and glitching and not reloading my weapons when I need to. But, oh, I thought the gunner protect me if I crouched from the Vortigaunt fire. Uh, anyway, uh, now we know stealth doesn't work, so let's just quickly get on the turret. Man the turret! Uh, I know crouching is useless, and so I do it anyway. I'm stupid, aren't I? Uh, Oh no, they're coming again. Look, this is like a shooting gallery gone wrong. It, it, because of how I'm... Yeah, because... Fortunately, this is quite fast to kill you now. Unfortunately... Oh, unfortunately, they transport so close to me that they're immediately within firing range. Uh, typical, isn't it? I could get on the turret fast, and the turret. Oh, how oh, did they kill me so fast that time? I think it's a case of Vortigaunt's um, uh, combining fire. Uh, yeah, I'm making when they combine their electricity, it makes it even stronger. Uh, okay, let's try a bomb this time, a grenade. Look, yes, uh, that's at least a scared them. Make their electricity. Uh, why aren't they coming back? Oh, oh no. It made their electrical attack uh, malfunction a bit. But it's so hard to aim this, isn't it? Uh, okay, uh, um, but I know that the uh, grenade attack works wonders. But unfortunately, the range isn't too great, is it? Okay. Why did you see the water guns? He, he was jumping. I wonder what could have caused him to jump, I wonder. It's always satisfying when you manage to shoot the Vox in the eye with a turret. Oh no, I'm getting hit now. They're gonna kill me if I'm not careful. Oh no, I took my eyes off them. It's not good playing this with OCD because of oh, because I lose focus quickly when dealing with my OCD here. Oh, oh, they keep trying to distract me by wasting me until I'm talking. There is, mm, it's not good trying to do these things with my OCD because I quickly lose focus when I get anxious and whatnot. Uh, uh, yeah. And um, that's a recipe for disaster when playing card games, isn't it? What's these uh, uh, engine sounds, these motor, these humming computer sounds I hear? Uh, he had a bad day, that soldier up there, didn't see here. Where is that humming fan sound coming from? Don't you just love all these bullet holes I made with a turret? Either I'm a bad shot or that turret fires way more bullets than there actually needs to. Uh, I wonder what could have happened to him though, maybe. 
It's amazing how he's still holding his gun despite his most painful face. His most painful face, isn't it? Uh, I don't know, I wonder what could, this could do. It's dirty a bit now with the Lord, but I'm sure it won't mind. Uh, this doesn't seem to do anything. Or maybe I need to jump while using it. Yes, like so. And now you know what happened to him, don't you? He had a he had a rather unfortunate mishap when um, trying to use the alien jumping pad, and he got stuck on a rather sharp hole. But yeah, it's amazing how he's still holding his assault rifle, isn't it? <laughs> He must have superhuman grip, that's all I can say if his corpse is still able to hold tight onto something. He must have the kind of grip the ravishing Rick Rude supposedly had, which is why he was a, a, a big arm, a, a, a well known for his arm wrestling when he was a wrestler in WWE, as well as well known for being a superhumanly tall. <laughs> Oh, he just threw a grenade at me, even though they're fighting aliens. What did he do that for? Oh. Oh, where did the snarks come from also? Um, okay, now that there's no one around to hear me, let's see if we can destroy this body. Yeah, so can he's bleeding. Let's see if he if he explodes into pieces. Uh, maybe he isn't going to. I'll try something else though, just in case. No, I guess his body is on giga on giga on gibbable. It's hard to use words that you've never used before, words which you don't even know whether they exist or not. Uh, and now the only way to get this health pack on top of that tallest box there is to jump onto it. I uh, almost didn't make that then, did I? I would have made myself look like an idiot if I'd failed to make that jump then, wasn't I? And now to loot the goodies from this little battle here which I did very little to take part in uh, which I contributed very little to and as you can see this is a non-destructible iron barrel unlike the ones we found in the um, um, in the apprehension chapter earlier in the game before the soldiers took all my weapons and tried to kill me in the trash compactor so because they did that their bodies must be destroyed yes and yours too Mr. Um, metal uh, metal on the pants wearer Yes, and imagine how painful that must be having your body armor literally nailed into your chest, maybe. Um, the, um, they, they don't really bear, bear much consideration for the comfort of the girl or for vast. Uh, they don't really bear much consideration for the comfort of these aliens, do they? But so as your comfort, your discomfort is over now, and so is yours, Mr. Slave Alien. I better check to make sure my face cam is still working after that interruption uh, with the EFS pop up here. Yeah. Um, no, um, I, uh, let's continue on. Uh, I hope no one can hack me or anything now that they know what my antivirus is. Uh, 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 yeah, uh, this doesn't look very, uh, safe, does it? I know. I once saw someone do this with this fly gun, so I'll try it myself. Uh, oh, 
Yes. Oh no! Oh! Yeah, the fly gun is amazing against snarks, isn't it? And for those of you don't, who don't know, oh! Oh no, they're, they're, they're coming after me, they're coming at me, snark bros! The snark bros coming at me and I don't necessarily like that. Yes, as you might have noticed by now, this gun fires flesh-eating flies. See how you hear them buzzing? And you can fire them in rapid fire mode too. Oh, did you see them push that barrel just then? Uh, uh, let me just get it out into the open and you'll see what I mean. Uh, does normal fire push it as well? No, normal fire strangely pulls it towards me. Well, let's push you again with rapid fire. Yeah, that's amazing, Dad. Quite satisfying, isn't it? Okay, let's just press on furthermore. Uh, um, wait a minute, let me look up how to... Uh, I get the feeling I didn't study this up enough, never mind, just a, a ruined rooftop type thing, yes. Yeah. Uh, and now, yes, I... Uh, those snarks are always sneaking up on us, aren't they? But alas... If video games are video games, then they give us things only when we need them. Or well, they tend to give us things when we need them. And I wonder what we could have... Oh no. Oh, they're shooting down the vents. What's the last? Remember what I was saying about games? Oh, oh no. Oh. Oh, remember what I was saying about games giving us things what we need when we need them. Oh, that's what we need these snarks for, isn't it? Having fun down there, soldier boys. <laughs> Having fun down there, soldier boys and snarks, eh? Okay, I, d I don't hear any more signs of life down there, so... Yes, that wasn't very much fun at all, was it, Mr. Soldier Boy, eh? Oh, well, he is some fun for me. Yes, quite so. Ooh. And not even your scary gas mask saved you from the power of snarks, did it? Yeah. Well, oh, look, lots of nice battery power for my HEV suit as well. Is it just me, or does this place remind me of the car garage from the madness, uh, from madness's um, driving in my car music video? Makes you feel like dancing in here, doesn't it? While pretending to work on the cars. I'm just dancing in my... I oh know, I'm just driving in my car. Da, 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 da. Yeah, while, pre uh, while pretending to uh, work on the car. It's not quite a Jaguar. Da, 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 da. Yeah, enough of that. <laughs> um... Let's, let's press on further. Oh yeah, an example of my stupidity here. The first time I got to this place, because this is like a car garage that you would have attached to a suburban house in, in American suburban streets or something, even though it's a bit big for one of them. I was imagining going out here and coming across suburban streets with trees and houses and pavements and the sun shining out there. How you could get from an isolated scientific facility in New Mexico to suburban city streets, well, I don't know, but don't ask me how my lunatic mind works, yeah. Don't ask me how my thought processes work, because I don't think anyone could explain that. 
I don't think anyone could explain the method to my madness. Oh, let us leave this place since there's nothing else to do except try and slurp on this tomato soup on the floor here to regain my health. And I think Alex would be rather scared, would be rather disgusted by that if she read stories about me licking this up uh, from when uh, from when we meet her in half five two. Fire team! Oh no! Fire team, go away! Uh, uh, stay away, fire team! Uh, 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 okay. Okay, so the fire team wants to blow me up, do they? Well, we'll see about that. Yes, we will. You go up. Oh, I hate it won't go up because um, we've got to press the switch again. These hanging electrical switches don't look too safe, do they? Uh, they don't look too safe or reliable. But in this desperate time, should we press the go with what we... Oh, 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 that was a very easy shot. Oh, oh, there's framing grenades at me still. Uh, uh, this, isn't, this isn't a game for people who suffer panic attacks, is it? Especially when you know how the these things can be. Uh, okay, up we go once more. Oh, 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 oh. That was so close, wasn't it? Oh, very nearly got killed again. Very nearly got spotted over the wall again. Very nearly lost my tomato soup all over the black mason walls. Yeah. And I don't know. Oh, he just fired a grenade. I heard the sound of his of his assault rifle firing a grenade, and that's a sound that any half-life player fears. The of a and the assault rifle firing a grenade. Now don't go recon. If you're gonna go recon, then run away recon. Oh no, looky here. He's shaking in fear because he hasn't been able to kill me. Let's put an end to his trepidatious nature. Yes. An arrow to the head will end. Well, we'll put an end to anyone's fear for nature. hey uh, Through the hole in the wall we go. And as you can see, this doorway is quite unsalvageable now. Yes. Oh, uh, for a minute I thought I was stuck there by uh, a game's um, inaccessibility glitch. Yeah, that's the professional name for glitches where you get stuck in places where you're not supposed to be. A game in accessibility glitch. So yes, uh, they don't call me a, liter a literary gaming genius for nothing. Why am I still hearing shooting going on? Surely all of the soldiers and grunts must be dead with all this action happening now. And another black sergeant. There's racial equality for you in the H in the HECU Marine Corps. And I believe in racial equality too. That's why I smash up the bodies of white men and black men alike. Yes, racial equality for the win. Ooh. I don't think this door opens uh, manually, does it? And what well, I wonder what this rather conveniently placed cannon could, how this rather conveniently placed cannon could help us here. Mm, don't think it's a very wise idea to dust off this um, cannon uh, before I fire it in case. Somehow the ghost of um, the ghost of Henry VIII fire, or the ghost of Napoleon fires it in my face and makes me look prettier with a free face with a free face left. Okay, open fire! Uh, oh no! Open fire! Oh, oh, oh. oh no! There's, there's more alien grunts in there. Fire! Oh, yes. Any more? Yes. Next. 
as you can tell I've watched too many uh, playthroughs of how I knew there was Florida, can't you? Uh, yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, let's say goodbye to this dilapidated building. Hey, I never noticed our air vent before. So, apparently, how many of the soldiers never shot down the air vent in the car garage? I would have been able to crawl straight out of here and then likely receive a, an assault rifle grenade in the mouth for my troubles. After all, no one likes an, no one likes an air vent freeman spying on them, do they? An air vent freeman? is the half-life equivalent of a ceiling cat. And if you don't know what a ceiling cat is, I'm not going to explain it because we need to keep this PG. Oh, oh no, I don't want to go down there. I wanted to watch the fight from the whole Oh, 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 Oh no, the flies are at me now. Oh, how did the fly come out of nowhere? Oh, I heard the game's cheating because it knows I'm elite. Did I hit him? He made a oh, 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 sound. So yes, maybe he was in pain and maybe that means I hit him. Oh, no, no, I think that was a fly sound so I didn't hit him after all, I don't think. Let's try to uh, mag them since my shooting with the uh, longbow wasn't very good. Oh, did you see that headshot that I knocked him out with? That face shot. Not even Mike Tyson can pack a punch like Granny's antique revolver. So, if anyone's holding any pity parties, you should um, hold one in honour of the alien grunts down there, yes. Okay, um, let's go down and investigate the the uh, scene of the battle down there. Yes, uh, really. uh, and there's no supplies. Fire team! Oh no, there are the people who tried to blow me up and set me on fire. Mm, yes, imagine going out wearing sh wearing shiny on these. They'd be a real attention getter, wouldn't they? I'm surprised women don't do that already. You know, women on the, you know, women on the streets who pretend they don't want attention from anyone, even though they go out wearing figure hunt, figure hugging outfits and trousers and whatnot. Yeah, stupid. Uh, there's tons of stupid. Um, uh, uh, stupid, irrational, fe lying females out there in the world, isn't it? They can all go and jump off trees for all I care. And as you can see, this car, this uh, tank isn't going to move us is with us in. They must have a rather rude anti-freeman policy. A rather rude anti-freeman policy, in effect. It's a good thing there's no one in it, though, to fire this cannon at me, though, isn't it? You know, like... Um, in that previous video pass where that tank killed me a million times in that battle where the where the uh, where the where the bomber plane killed a load of uh, alien grunts. More soldier bodies to hack up it seems, yes. Okay, and uh, supplies in here for me now. The first times I played this I thought that those um radioactive laser type bullet things were money notes. After all, if you don't really look at them, they do look like a bit like money notes, except that they're all boxy. Or oh, unless I was just playing with the original graphics and they look more like paper money with the original graphics than they do with these graphics. Than they do... Than they do with these graphics. No idea, really. Ah, uh, battery power again. You know, since I can never really seem to keep my health when I play this. Although the fact that, uh, that I'm suffering all of those glitches, control glitches, doesn't really help. Look at me, I'm sitting on one of the shelves, on one of the shelves. So if anyone comes here and says, I'd like to buy a, I'd like to buy a Freeman, please. 
Well, then the staff, then the shop staff knows where to come. Just, uh, I just hope they don't sell me too cheaply because it won't hurt my little baby feelings, you see. It might make me cry even, yes. <laughs> uh, so, uh, and I can't jump on this tank either, no. So, we must ascend, yes. Ascend to the higher platforms. And uh, rather than risk my health trying to jump this, uh, these treacherous gaps, I'll instead clamber up onto the railing, balancing like Houdini, uh, if he ever did balance at all, that is. And uh, now do the jump from this high vantage point, which proved highly advantageous to me in my efforts not to lose health, so yay me. Uh, I've been going for... Um, uh, over um, half an hour now, so let's just press on and hope we don't come across anything particularly nasty. And then soon I'll stop the video. Yes, listen to those sounds. So that must be aliens. Ah! Oh no, I wonder what could have done that. Oh, hi there. Yes, uh, that didn't go as well as I thought it was, so... This far is scary. Oh no. They take a ton of bullets down, don't they? Well, that certainly didn't go very well. At least now I know what to do, what not to do when fighting, uh, when fighting uh, alien grunts, don't I? Uh, say goodbye to your body, Mr. Soldier. Oh, because the soldier was scheduled to go for a scripted event, that means his body is indestructible and metal. Okay, um, there's soldiers nearby in a big fight nearby, so I'll stop the video here and um, save and um, so, that was hard save and I'll see you next time, friends. Yes, goodbye.